Our first morning, we attend the annual Ushugatsu Festival at the captivating Morikami Museum and Japanese Gardens. The museum and grounds celebrate Japanese culture and heritage. Walking through the manicured gardens, we feel transported to Japan for a moment, forgetting that we're in South Florida. The museum offers a variety of exhibitions, including history, art, and cultural celebrations. Today is dedicated to celebrating Oshogatsu, the traditional Japanese New Year festival, with games and entertainment throughout the museum and its gardens. We're here today at the Morikami Museum and Japanese Garden. This is one of Palm Beach's most treasured cultural attractions. And we're fortunate to be visiting on a very special day, the Japanese New Year called Osugatsu. There's plenty of attractions to see and things to do for the whole family. So come along and let's go celebrate. The day's activities include Japan's customary rice pounding, making mochi rice cakes and a sadu tea ceremony, as well as hands-on calligraphy called kakizome, ningaju, which is New Year's card making, and Japanese fortune telling or umiguji. To usher in good luck for the New Year, Shishimai, the lion dancer, appears throughout the festivities. An array of children's activities keep our son busy throughout our time at the festival. These include Anitsuki, a Japanese game similar to badminton, Jan Ken Pon, a traditional activity similar to rock, paper, scissors, craft making to honor the year of the rabbit, garden trek origami making, and a fun kids obstacle course. Uh, we're gathered here today at the Morikami Museum in Japanese Gardens here in Delray Beach, Florida. We're owned and operated by Palm Beach County uh, as a county park. Uh, the, uh, we're uh, on land that was uh, donated to uh, Palm Beach County by a Japanese expatriate who was a longtime resident of this county, a man whose name was George Morikami, who came to South Florida in the early years of the 20th century uh, to join a pioneering community of Japanese settlers called the Yamato Colony that once existed in our area. Uh, today is uh, our celebration of Oshogatsu, the Japanese New Year. Uh, Japanese celebrate the New Year on the Western calendar, so uh, the New Year holiday season was around the 1st and a couple of days or so uh, after the 1st of January. But uh, we're celebrating today on the, uh, the 9th of January. Uh, we have a variety of activities taking place that uh, uh, follow custom in Japan. We're, we're pounding steamed rice to make New Year's rice cakes called mochi. All right, now we're steaming the rice. We'll st uh, when it's uh, properly steamed, we'll put it into a large mortar and proceed to pound it with long-handled mallets called kine. We'll pound it into an amorphous dough-like mass from which we'll pull wads to hand mold into individual rice cakes, which our visitors today can try. Uh, it's a confection uh, that is associated with the Japanese celebration of the new year uh, in Japan. And uh, it's also uh, consumed as uh, parts of uh, other, uh, other um, uh, cuisine that's served at this time of the year. It's uh, served in a kind of stew or soup called ozoni, uh, and it's also available as uh, part of the uh, New Year's uh, feast called osechi ryori uh, as well. 